The situations portrayed in this program are very dangerous. They have been performed by trained professionals in order to replicate worst case scenarios of real life hazards. Viewers should not, under any circumstances, attempt to replicate any of the situations presented in the program. Everybody knows that you should never take an electrical appliance into the bathtub with you. Nonetheless, consumer products like the hairdryer still kill an average of 75 North American adults every year. But what does it actually take for a dummy to get zapped? Everybody's afraid of electrocuting themselves in the bathtub, right? That is true. In the morning, you've got a curling iron, a hair dryer going on in the bathroom, and you've got running water everywhere. Yeah, you have a hair dryer and curling iron running at the same time? I do. It looks good. Thank you. But we are legitimately afraid of electrocuting ourselves in the bathroom. Absolutely. So we're going to see how realistic that fear really is. We've got a hair dryer, we're going to plug it in. We've got our mannequin, which rigged up with some twinkle lights in the bathtub. We're going to throw this thing in and see what happens. And that's the test. If the twinkle lights come on, there's enough electricity in the water to kill a human. It's going to light up like a Christmas tree. Exactly. Plug in the hair dryer. All right. The hair dryer is working. We're going to throw it in, see what happens. Ready in three, two, one. Guys, can we get the lights back on? I, I kind of figured this would happen. We just basically blew the circuit. So what you're saying is it's okay to blow dry my hair while I'm in the bath? No, no, I'm not saying that it's okay to put an electrical appliance into your bathtub. What I am saying, however, is that there's a lot of things that need to go wrong in order for you to electrocute yourself. Gotcha. To keep people from being electrocuted, most new homes across Europe and North America have a built-in safety measure. Normally, electricity flows out of the outlet, through an appliance, and back into the outlet. Inside the circuit is a ground fault interrupter, or a GFI, that measures the current going in and out. If a human body enters the circuit, it draws power that doesn't go back into the outlet. If the difference in the current is as little as five milliamps, the GFI kicks in, shutting off the circuit, you stay alive. If you do want to see this thing electrocuted, I can show you how. All right, guys, it looks good. Let's get it down by a mailbox. In order to demonstrate a real electrocution, Dan is bringing the experiment outside, where he has a power generator without a built-in GFI. Perfect. Just like in the bathroom, Dan's experiment must create a circuit, except this time, there'll be nothing to measure the current going in and out, allowing the electricity to travel from the hairdryer into the water, through the mannequin, and back to the generator without any interruption. Frying anyone stupid enough to be standing in the bathtub. It's good to start filling up the tub? Yes, madam. The ladies are loving this. All right, that looks like about enough water. Drinking water is nowhere near as conductive as salt water is. So for example, let's say our handsome mannequin decided to have one of these lovely, refreshing spa baths. So now, we've got water that's about 100 times more conductive than normal drinking water. Next thing we need to do, set up our hair dryer with our generator. And then drop it in. And then drop it in. Yeah! You should be terrified. Are you scared? Say nothing if you want us to go. I think he wants us to go. We're good to go. All right, everybody, we're good to go. Can I uh, borrow that for just one second? What? Thanks. In three, two, one. They're lighting up. <laughs> this is yes. amazing. Huh? We did it. This is really dangerous. This water right now is completely electrified, and our dummy, as you can see, is, is literally getting electrocuted. When we threw that hair dryer in, 
We're introducing electricity, and if you are the thing that completes that circuit, you're gonna get fried.